Hello my beautiful Bitterroots and welcome to my channel and today I am doing a collab for you all. The collab is called Fall Back Collab and basically the collab anything goes just as long as it's fall colored related. So I got to thinking I'm like okay well since possibilities are endless what I could do I decided to do something a little different than what everybody else kind of does for fall videos and so I wanted to show you some of my favorite um, things for fall just a, a handful of stuff as of right now but then I wanted to show you what I, I what I do for Halloween in particular just for um, those children who have food allergies I am a part of the teal pumpkin project so I am the only one in like a 30 to 50 mile radius around me who is doing this and basically the teal pumpkin project the, the, what it's about it's for children who have food allergies so Halloween is not fun for those children who have food allergies so I make up little goodie bags for those children who come to my door and they state state hey I have food allergies so I have a special goodie bag for them that's non-food related and I kind of go out a little more than what I normally do because for candy I just do a handful of candy pass out to the kids but because so far I only have one child stopping by the house that has a food allergy and I know that this will be my third year doing the teal pumpkin project I know as time goes on I'll be getting more children who are requesting uh, non-food item for Halloween so I wanted to show you guys what I do for that and kind of just throw, show you what I do for my goodie bags but first let's go with some of my fall favorites as of right now so these are brand new to me Lissa was the one that actually picked these little ankle booties up they are super comfortable they came from Old Navy and I love the little buckle and then it's got a zip on the side I uh, wore a beautiful burgundy dress with um, navy tights and then with these boots and that was my outfit for the wedding and it was super cute and I felt amazing in them and I was on my feet all day with these boots on um, these have got like a little cushy heel so um, I made it all day in these boots and yeah they're super cute and thanks to Lissa she's the one that picked them out for me so that's one thing that's one of my favorites. <clears throat> Another thing that I love for the fall that I love to grab and that I'll be using a lot in the fall, and I don't know if you can still get this, I think maybe allwholesalecosmetics.com might still have them, but it's the Cargo Cosmetics and this is the Vintage Escape Eye Palette. And this is what I have on my eyes right now. I am wearing withered leaves on my eyelids. I used autumn and hot cocoa for my transition shades. I used crisp for my inner corner highlight, harvest moon for my brow bone. I deepened up um, the color with rustic and with frolic. And so that's all that I have on my eyelids right now. I absolutely love it. It's beautiful. I mean, so I'll just swatch a few. So this one's cinnamon and this one's frolic leaves, the green one. And they're so beautiful. And if you still have a chance to get your hands on this palette, I definitely suggest it. It's beautiful. I love it. I love it. So let's go in. Oh, and then a couple more things. These are things that I found early on in at the Dollar Tree. And I filmed it, but I haven't uploaded the video, and it was like a couple months ago when they first started putting out their fall stuff. But at the Dollar Tree, I found this beautiful cross that says Autumn Blessings. Super cute. And then I found these, which say Harvest, Give Thanks, Falling Leaves, Autumn Gatherings, Happy Fall, y'all, and Pumpkin Patch. And this one says Harvest Blessings, Corn Maze, Pumpkin Pie, Apple Cider, Hay Rides, and Thanksgiving. So these are some fun little things that I'll put up in the house. I normally don't go completely all out for all seasons. The one I completely go all out of for is Christmas. But I saw those and I'm like, you know what, those are really cute. I think I'll put them up. So 
let's go into the teal pumpkin project and what I do for those children who have food allergies if they come to my house. So let's go on into what I have. Okay, so here's a quick little overview. This I need to print off again, but it's just a, a teal pumpkin at my door to show the kids who have food allergies that this is a food allergy safe place. There is an option for those um, children. It rained last year, so I've got like watermarks all over my pumpkin. But I just kind of wanted to show you all the stuff that I kind of throw into my little goodie bags. So I've got um, tattoos here. I've got pencils, I've got these fun little things, bracelets, uh, bat rings, and then some other little randoms, um, silly straws because they're always fun. And so, and then one thing that I am missing that I do need to go pick up is some glow sticks because I always like to put in a nice big thick glow stick in the bags so that way they can. Um, I break them when I give it to them, and that's all good. And then I found these cute little treat bags at the Dollar Tree. There were six of them for a dollar, so these are super cute little goodie bags. <clears throat> and you don't, you don't have to go all out like I am, just because I don't have that many kids that come to my door. So I buy a lot of this stuff at the Dollar Tree, and because I only have one kid, I like to do a little more for him. But if you have a lot of kids that come over, just grabbing pencils and just giving them a pencil or, you know, something like that to where there's something that's fun for them but um, that's non-food related. So here are the cute little baggies. So I'm just going to go through and just start grabbing stuff and filling my little baggies. So little Halloween tattoos. We'll throw in a teeth. We'll throw in one of these bad boys and one of these. i got two different types of pencils here. We'll throw in a silly straw, a couple different bracelets, a couple different rings, um, an owl eraser. Um, I got these cute little sharpeners. And so, yeah, I just kind of grab that, just kind of shove them all in, and then just make all my little goodie bags. So I'm only going to make up six this year, and then the rest are just going to go back in the box. And, um, oh, and I forgot. Do a couple. Oh, yeah, I did it. Do these. Never mind. I died. A couple rings, teeth, a couple different pencils, and a silly straw, and an eraser, and that. Okay, did I get everything? I did. Okay. Make sure I don't forget about the silly straws. Can't forget about the silly straws. <clears throat> and then I'll just grab a few of these little tattoos. And oh, one of those. So my bags are complete. I'm just gonna just throw in a few of these in too. Okay, open. Okay. Um, okay, so this is what I have left over. I still got quite a bit left over, but that's okay. I just throw it all in a box for next year and then just fill up some more baggies as I go. So yeah, let's get all these put away. <coughs> Okay, so there we go with all of these. The only thing I need to do is add, uh, buy some of the big glow sticks, so that way the kids have um, a nice glow stick for when they're out trick-or-treating. So that is the end of my video. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope that this was different than what you would typically see for fall collaborations. So 
Um, thank you guys for joining me and see you in my next video. Bye.